This is the last template. This is last template of IODB. This is non-decreasing integer sequence problem. What is this one? Non-decreasing integer sequence problem. With example, this will be clear. This is a confusing problem. Let me tell you. This is very confusing. So with example, for this problem, just to solve the questions. We will solve the question. This is a gate 2015 question. Let's solve it. Let's solve it. Very simple question. Now let's try this. From this set, from this set, you want to create a four digit number. From this set, you want to create a four digit number. Their digits must be in non decreasing order from left to right. Okay, so from this set, remember from what I'm saying from one two three from this set you want to create a four digit number four digit number you want to create okay and the digits must be in the non decreasing order the digits must be in the no so four digit number with digits in non decreasing order non decreasing order so tell me is this a valid number is this a valid number? This is not valid. Non decreasing. There must be non decreasing. Is this valid number? Is this valid number? No, this is also not valid. This is also not valid. Is this valid number? Yes, this is valid. Is this valid number? Yes, this is valid. Is this valid number? This is valid. So all these are valid numbers. Okay, clear? Very simple. This is valid number one, two, three, three. This is also valid. So now you notice one very interesting thing you notice. Very interesting thing you notice. Once you select, okay, just tell me, just tell me, this is my set. From this set, I want to create four digit number. From this, I, I want to create four digit with a decreasing order. Four digit with non, non decreasing order. This is what I want. Now see what will happen. Very interesting thing which will happen. Okay, this is one, this is two, this is three. If I take two ones and two twos, then will I get a unique number? Like if I take two ones, two twos, zero three, will I get a unique number? Will I get a unique number? Yes, you will get a unique number, right? A four digit number with a non decreasing order. You will get a unique number. This number you will get. You will get a unique number. If I give you this, will you get a unique number? Will you get a unique number? Yes, you will get a unique number. This number you will get. If I give you a number, where what will be the corresponding combination? What is the corresponding combination? 400. Zero, zero. If I give you this number, the corresponding combination is 004. If I give you this number, the corresponding combination is 022. So basically from this set, using these three digits, okay, from this set, you want to create four digit number you want to create, four digit number. With decreasing, this condition is there with the non-decreasing order. With non-decreasing order of digits, order of digits. So here you can notice what matters. Okay, you, you create a number, then what matters? Only it matters how many one you are taking, how many two you are taking, how many three you are taking. Only this matters, yes or no? How many one you are taking, how many two you are taking, how many three you are taking. For example, if I take three ones, and if I take this, if I take three ones, if I take three ones and one three, then only this number I can create. Only this number I can create unique number i can create yes or no so what matters it matters how many ones you are taking how many twos you are taking how many threes you are taking okay for every combination you will get a unique like if i give you this one two one then you will get a unique number what number you will get what number you will get you will get one two two three this number you will get so finally, so what should be the answer for this question? This is your gate exam question. So here, 
Now you tell me the final answer. So using these digits, using one, two, three, only you can use these using these boxes, these digits. How many we want? Four digit number we want. We want four digit number. Okay. This condition is important with the non decreasing order. So here, this is same as your star bar problem. These are your boxes. These are the boxes. So there will be, so using these, so I can say how many bars, two bars. Total, we want four digits. Total, we want four digits. So star four, total, we want four digits. So we want total four digit we want. So like this. So here it will be 62. So the answer will be 64. This will be the answer. Did you understand? In the same question, if I do non-increasing order, will the answer change? If I do non-increasing order, will the answer change non-increasing order? The same. Okay, because with okay can you give me unique will i get unique will i get unique will i get unique which number i will get for this combination i am taking two one one two one three which number i will get i will get this number unique number i will get so this is also fine non increasing order this is also fine so let's solve this a sequence is non decreasing this is the non decreasing sequence i need to find the number of non decreasing sequence of length n of length n from this set from this set so tell me who are the boxes tell me who are the boxes who are the boxes who are the boxes so we have total m boxes we have total m boxes we have so we have m minus one bars we have m minus one bars and we want total n stars we want so basically we want length n this length n we want we want length n non decreasing we want non decreasing sequence we want so what matters only it matters how many ones you are taking how many twos you are taking how many so what matters it matters these are the boxes one two three m these are the boxes these are your boxes so it matters how many ones I'm taking, how many twos I'm taking, how many threes I'm taking. So this is what matters. So what will be the answer? Tell me the answer. The answer will be M plus N minus one C N. This will be your answer. Okay. So non decreasing sequence. This is the problem of non decreasing sequence. The idea is this, because once you select once you select some numbers, then only unique combination, the only unique number you will get. How many non-decreasing sequence of length R? I want non-decreasing sequence of length R can be formed from this, can be created from this. So from this, I want, okay, length R I want. So for example, if I want length three, if I want length three, then what it means? Then what are the possible answers? Like this is allowed. Like this is also fine. I want non decreasing. So this is also fine. So this is also fine. So this is also fine. And so on. So this is the idea. So what here, what, what is happening here? If you know how many ones you are taking, how many twos you are taking, how many threes you are taking and how many ones you are taking. If you know how many these you are taking, then you will get a unique number, right? See. If I take zero this, if I take two this, if I take one this, and if I take everything is zero, then what number I will get? If I take this combination, then what number I will get? Which sequence I will get? Non-decreasing. I want non-decreasing. So this sequence I will get two, two, three. This sequence of length three I will get. This is sequence of length three I will get. So what will be the answer? So the total answer, answer will be basically your total length three you want. So three stars you have. So these are your stars and N minus one bars you have. So there will be N minus one bars, three stars, C3. And the same thing you can do here. 
this length r this is what you want non decreasing sequence so these are your stars and these are your boxes so there will be n minus 1 bars so the answer will be r plus n minus 1 cr this is another how many non decreasing sequence of a finite length are there so like okay this, like the same thing there is nothing changed so you from this set from this set how many sequences of length n you can create okay such that they are in non decreasing order they are in non decreasing order they are in non decreasing order how many sequences you can create so very simple so basically here this length n this length n this is your stars because total you want stars means what you want total how many you want a star means total how many you want total how many you want so we want total n and from what you want these are the boxes these are your boxes so there will be k minus 1 bars so the answer is the answer is k minus 1 plus n c n so remember stars means total how many you want total how many you want this is what star means whenever you want to find what is star total how many you want and boxes means from what you want from what you want so there will be k minus 1 bars okay this is interesting so tell me the answer for this question how many what is the number of n digit natural numbers n digit natural numbers such so that they have non decreasing order which have non decreasing order what is the answer for this n digit natural number their digits are in natural number so what are the boxes anyone want to tell me what are the boxes the boxes are 1 to 9 what is the reason zero is not in the box can anyone tell me zero you cannot have zero right you cannot have zero zero you cannot have please understand this you cannot have zero you because you cannot start with zero you cannot start with zero and because of non decreasing order you cannot have zero agree you cannot start with zero because you want n digit natural number you cannot start with zero and because you have non decreasing order so you cannot use zero again so these are your boxes 1 to 9 these are the boxes and you, you okay these are the stars so you have total n stars you have total we want n digit so the answer will be here the answer will be n plus 8 c 8 because the number of bars you have 9 8 bars how many two digit natural numbers are there two digit natural numbers please tell me how many two digit natural numbers are there how many two digit natural numbers so they will start from 10 and they will go till 99 these many two digit natural numbers you have how many two digit natural numbers you have so here you cannot put zero so nine choices here you cannot put zero so nine choices now here you can put anything so 10 choices so how many so there are total 92 digit number are there two digit natural numbers are there this 00 is not a two digit number okay this is not a two digit number so this is clear because the question is asking n digit natural number so you can do this okay some interesting variations very interesting variation in the same question if i make non increasing will the answer change will the answer change if i do non increasing will the answer change tell me tell me tell me will the answer change if i do non increasing yes now the answer will change because now zero can be there you want non increasing you want non increasing it means zero can be there now zero can be there now your boxes are what 
now your boxes are 0 1 2 and so on 9 now these are your boxes your boxes are these and you have total n n n digit you want so these are your n stars these are your n stars and from here you can notice that there are total how many bars you have so total nine bars you have so there will be total nine bars so the answer will be nine n plus nine c nine is this correct answer is this correct answer so what is wrong here so what should i do i i want to get a correct answer what should i do what should i do i want a, i want to get a correct answer Are only just remove one. This is the correct answer. This one is for all zeros. This one is for all zeros. Only remove one. That's it. This is your correct answer. You only have to remove the all zeros. The all zeros you have to remove. That's it. Please check it. Okay. See, I want non decrease. Okay. This is just a confusing word. This non increasing. This is a confusing word, right? I have always found this is a very confusing word. I always find this as a confusing word. So prefer decreasing. Just make it decreasing. Just make it decreasing. Just make it decreasing. Now tell me how many decreasing numbers you can have which start with zero. How many decreasing numbers you have which start with zero? Which start with zero? How many decreasing? Which start with zero? Only one. How many are here in this, in this, how many you can, how many you can create, which start with zero, only one. So when all zeros are there, only this number we have to remove. Only this number we have to remove. Nothing else we have to remove. This one we have to remove for all zeros. Is this clear? Let me ask another question. If here, if I do strictly decreasing, if I do strictly decreasing, if I do strictly decreasing, then what is the answer? Now I'm asking strictly decreasing. This would be strictly decreasing. So how many n digit you want n digit numbers? So for example, let's assume that. Okay, let's assume you want five digit. Let's assume you want five digit numbers which okay in strictly decreasing order so because you are in strictly decreasing order this is same as selection yes or no see because you want strictly decreasing nothing can repeat nothing can repeat right because you want strictly decreasing nothing can repeat no number can repeat no number can repeat so what you do? No number can repeat. So just select five. There are total nine digits. Total there are nine. Uh, total there are ten digits. From them you select five. But you want decreasing strictly decreasing order you want. Okay. So from ten you can select five. Whichever five you select, they will give you one. For example, whichever five you select. For example, if I select these. Okay, if I select these, then which answer I will get? If I select these, then what I will get? I want decreasing, strictly decreasing. So this unique I will get, unique. This unique I will get. So I can say answer is 10C5. Just select five, select five. Whatever five you select, whatever five you select, you will get unique decreasing order. You will get unique decreasing order. So this is what happens. Like if I select, for example, if I select 1, 2, 0, 9, 8, if I select these five, then I will get, then I will get this. Is this clear? All these variations, small, small variations I am creating. All these variations, are they clear? What about increasing? Strictly increasing. If I do strictly increasing strictly increasing order five digit five digit numbers five digit natural numbers with strictly increasing order 
now now you have to do now you have to do 9c5 now you have to do 9c5 you cannot select zero you cannot select zero select you cannot even select zero can you select zero like you are selecting five can you select these numbers can you select these numbers you cannot select these five numbers you cannot even select zero you cannot select zero you cannot select zero so you cannot select zeros zero selection cannot be there in value so for this question answer will be 9c5 can't select zero okay so all the variations we have seen i hope all these are clear can you answer this how many seven digit uh, decreasing numbers are there see by default decreasing does not mean strictly decreasing by default decreasing does not mean strictly decreasing okay so for example this is given to you that this is a decreasing number so this is a variation of this is what template this is your which template your iodb template this is your iodb template this is basically iodb template so seven digit decreasing numbers for example like this you want then what should be the answer seven digit you want so there are seven stars we want total seven digits so seven stars are there and total nine bars are there because the boxes are what the boxes are zero one two nine these are the boxes you want seven digit number this is what you want you want seven digit number so these are the things okay decreasing order you want so the answer will be what the answer will be seven stars plus nine bars c7 just make sure okay just make sure this this zero this zero you should make sure in this all the zero are also selected please take care about the zero please take care about the zero in this case all the zeros are also selected this case we are removing for all zeros when all the zeros are selected this case we are removing for it so very simple right so like this you can do okay summary this is the summary of iodb templates all the iodb templates we have seen these are the all the iodb templates did you understand just tell me because see i can promise you one thing i can promise you today's class what we have seen these variations these this explanation all these things you will not find like this is a collection in one book you will not find all of them okay in different different resources i have taken and only these are possible let me tell you only these five iodb problems are there five iodb like combination with repetition this is your cwr this is your iodb identical object distinct boxes this is your iodb this is your non negative integer solution problem this is your non negative integer solution problem this is your multi set problem and this is your uh, no uh, non decreasing non increasing integer sequence problem integer sequence problem non decreasing non increasing these five templates are there we have seen all of them everything we have seen 